This is the special technique you guys should use against drop back players and players who's applying less pressure on you. And it's simple guys. Okay, look here, pay close attention. It's called, all you need to do is stand still. Just for a while. Like look here, I'm standing still. There's two ways to use this. I'll get into the second technique after showing this here. Okay, look here, I'm standing still. See when your opponent ap applies pressure on you. If he's applying pressure from this side, right? You go towards the, the other direction. Like look, stand still for a while. Drop all my buttons on my controller. Go to the other direction. See, it's that simple. Another example, why I'm showing this and also showing examples because many people like don't use it and it's a very simple technique. Look, I just stand still for a while and here what I'm doing, here's another method on how to use it. Not only when your opponent's applying pressure on you, you use it. Also when your opponent's not applying pressure on you, you use it and you basically calculate like in your mind where you're going to pass. Like here for example, I just want to show you guys here. Let me just get out the software. Okay, look here. Here in my mind, I'm standing still for a while. If you look at the controller, I drop down everything. And what I'm doing now, see, he's not applying pressure on me. I'm calculating in my mind, what must I do? I'm thinking three steps ahead. I'm doing, or thinking two steps ahead. I'm doing these calculations. Like I know I'm gonna pass to him. Step one, step two, pass to him. It all started while I was standing still, I recalculate this in my mind and just look. So you can also use it in that kind of method. Look, passing the ball in triangular patterns also. Look, I stand still and all of a sudden I increase my tempo. And here, look, I got a goal. I got a goal. It all started while I was standing still. Here for a while, I'm standing still, calculating. I see my opponents coming from there. I go with the run button down, pass to Messi. See, and it all started while I was standing still. And that's how I calculated that. So, yeah, stand still for a while, go a different direction. As you can see where that player was applying pressure towards me, I go the opposite direction. So you see, you guys can use it in two variations, not only in one variation. Yeah, again, this opponent actually quit. Stand still for a while, go the opposite direction, quickly make passes, Triangular passes, as you guys can see, I did that calculations, I think ahead. They had a pass to him, there, look, go. It all started while I was standing still. Yeah, again, stand still for a while. If you guys, they look here, look at my controller. There, look, I did let go of all my buttons. I did stand still, so the gaps, everything, they open up. Go the other direction. Stand still for a while, pass in triangular patterns, which is very important. This opponent ended up quitting also. Yeah, if I'm not mistaken, yeah, I quit. He did quit. So remember guys, let me just go back. So remember guys, you use the standing still method when your opponent is applying pressure on you and then you turn a different direction and that will open up gaps or maybe lead to a pass or a true ball and also you use it basically stand still and calculate your surroundings and think two or three steps ahead like what I was doing here I was standing still for a while then as you guys can see I was passing in triangular patterns this is a sweet and short video it marks the end of this video anyways guys if you guys now want to learn about how to attack like a pro Increase your tempo and all of that and your reflexes. Click on this video right here guys. I will catch you in the next video. Peace out guys.